Hi everybody, uh, welcome to new tutorial. This is the tutorial about uh, landscape tool. Uh, today I'm going to show you how you can import landscape uh, map, height map, and use it in your level. So create a new level. Uh, we don't need this floor, delete it. Now go to the landscape mode again. Here is the landscape. So uh, previous day we show how to create. We change the location. We change the size. We can we change the size per component. But today I'm going to show you how we can import uh, landscape from the height map. Now I have few height height map in PNG format. So open the this is image PNG format we can view it there is a white and black white and black white represent height and black represent uh, flat so that's the three map uh, i have so if i import the first one you see all the height map resolution and scale and uh, number per component uh, uh, section size all are there and our landscape is created so there is a fog that's all you can see so height uh, uh, fog uh, lower the height fog now you can see you can see the landscape so uh, this is the difference between your scalping and uh, import in height map there is uh, every detail of it and now import the second height map and make it here you can see there is also resolution 90 905 now that's the difference from the uh, first one there is you can see the you can see the landscape i have also made a road using uh, a flutter flutter tool so now i will import uh, the third uh, landscape and that's the big landscape you can see the resolution uh, 6000 and 7000 uh, you can see it's bigger than the previous two I make it here and import so this is a very big height map compared to other two uh, that's why it will take a few times to generate but my point is you can import a uh, landscape and you can modify it with your sculpting tool uh, that's how you can make beautiful of your uh, landscape so now came to the third landscape and you can see how beautiful it is it's it's look like a grand canyon so you can import and make a height map like that you can get help from third party software or google map i don't know research yourself but i'm showing it how it's uh, currently working maybe it will uh, improve in future now we can create a landscape i want to make it small create now the uh, third option uh, is we can sculpt the landscape and we can uh, then export the landscape anywhere in unreal engine we can export it in png format and use any level any project or anywhere we prefer in unreal engine so i just made few changes i add few function i add few noise smooth is sculpting and then i export it and then i also import it so i add few version you can see the changes here is the here is the smooth flutter so i want to make a road like that and then i want to go from here uh, that's the road i made now 
now we can export it from here import and export to files we can export the same landscape in png format and then if we import it it will look like same so there is export op option and select the folder and select the name i name it uh, test uh, the map and that is press the export that is exported now we can create a landscape from the same file i just import it make it here we need to go to the manage a new uh, import the same file now you can see both are same both the landscape are the same so that's how you can import and export uh, the landscape uh, file from one project to another project or one level to another level now delete this delete all of this now i will show you how you can generate a landscape from a third party software delete this mm, i don't want to delete this it can stay now you can go to the world machine software that's a level uh, landscape generate software you can download it for free there is also a paid version paid version have lot of option but uh, a free version have a very few function so i just open uh, world machine basic so if you open the world machine you will generate a landscape like that it is the default there is a terrain creation filter and output function already given i want to add a curve if i drag and search the curve function will show and if we double click it will show more option we can change the option we can change the other thing now go to the project setting and we want to export it in unreal engine landscape resolution 109 1009 and 1009 that's the free version highest resolution if you want to go further you, you should buy it now i just change a few curve and you can see the viewport is changing we can change like full curve gentle five so i think uh, this is the perfect now we can add a erosion and change the there is a 12 preset in erosion change the erosion and make it your own way by changing the function you can see i have a lot of uh, function to change so i made like that it it have a detail more detail than other i don't have time there is also tutorial about wall machine so generate your own preference level from there so add with the height output and you should uh, give the export location and the file format should be always 16 bit raw otherwise you cannot use it in unreal engine so if you press right to disk it will just export now come to unreal engine and select yes our output to that's the output to now we can import it our landscape generate on there zero 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 so drag and drop here and if we generate you can see uh, detail it is it's too much detail how i mean what we wanted it's the same same way so now you can change this add material as your preference add road add building uh, add uh, whatever you prefer so that's how uh, game development level is generated so i am adding the road so you can change like that so this is for today's tutorial uh, bye everybody and see you in uh, next tutorial